Uh, okay, guys, we're in, and we are doing baby birds only. That means you can only use duckling, hatching chick, and the chick you get from pilling a rooster when you hit end turn. You can buy and sell everything else that you want, buy any food you want, including honey and popcorn that isn't in this pack. Uh, but yeah, end turn, only have those three baby birds on your team, please. Which means I may buy and sell this for now for, like, an easy apple, but definitely going to be looking for those baby birds. Some ducklings, thank you. All right. Let's just buff this up then. I feel like having one big baby duck is probably <laughs> a decent strat to start. And yeah, we don't need the rest of this. We will be the bold bushes. You <laughs> have two ducklings and two more frozen. Wonderful. I'm kind of jealous. I'm just like, I don't trust. Like, now that I've found one, I'm just going to buff it. I'll buy the other ones when I find them, but I'm not rolling for more. I'm taking cheap stats if they show up. <laughs> I believe in you. Oh yeah, looks like it. Oh. I don't think I go for the combination. <laughs> I think I buy sell all of these individually, and then we get a roll and potentially another buy. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> this is, that's a scary turn too. <laughs> Alright, so what's happening next turn? You can find hatching chicks from combinations next turn or from pilling spiders. I probably wouldn't. Which means I'm probably still just going to try and buff it up with stuff like this. I'm wondering if I like buy an apple as well. Like there really aren't that many things to do. I'm going to freeze it. I think I'm doing that. <laughs> I'm just going to keep pushing this. I only need one monster duck. If you get level 2 hatching, do you win? Mm. I don't know, because it's only 2-2 two, two a turn. And like, you could just get lucky and just find like a lot of zebras or something, and then it'll completely negate someone scaling from just the <laughs> level 2 hatching chick. Oh, dude, we're getting like loads of scaling. Oh, pill. Pill, is there anything worth pilling? Pill and ant, but it's not really worth it. I'm loving the mice and uh, otters. Pilling a spider is a maybe, because I could maybe find this. This would also be great. I think I just roll it. I need to... Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> now I'm going to freeze a pill, because now if I buy this, uh, I can like pill a flamingo and it hits both. And that is worth it. Monster duck for the win. Oh, he will. Look at this. Cannot be defeated. He can be traded with, but not defeated. <laughs> right. The question is whether I just buy the apple. Because this this apple here is as good as rolling and then buying and selling like mice and otters and stuff. But I would have to roll anyway. But Yeah, I think I just buy the, buy the apple and unfreeze this. If we find another apple or another otter or something worth buy selling, then we'll do that. And I'm going to pump this. There's a good chance I just end up combining these. I want to guarantee that it goes on this one. So I'm going to buy the apple over the otter. Because there is a good chance I'll combine these. Because it's way cooler to find loads of hatching chicks next turn. So, yeah. <laughs> next turn, we want garlic on this. Yeah, garlic on here. And then I want to find as many hatching chicks as possible. You just realize when you place a stalk, it's a baby crying, but not when using it. I don't know what it's like, invite sound is if it has one. I probably buy this, right? If I end up combining them, then we find a rooster, then that's probably worth something. I'm gonna leave the snail. I don't think we're gonna lose. Oh. <laughs> I don't actually want this many. Honestly, I would have been fine not buying any of these. But they're too cute. I couldn't not buy them. Let's see then. How's this going? Starting to see some of these around. And these are early as well. These aren't, um, that was pre-turn three or tier three. Yeah, looking good so far. Jelly, <laughs> Jelly, did you actually die? Oh no. Jay's got this. What are the scariest teams here? Skies is kind of spooky there. Oh. <laughs> So strong. Why did I even freeze a snail? I'm just wasting a slot. And I'm not buying guinea pigs for a combo chance. That's almost tempting. Like, buy that and then roll, see if we can find a thing with more stats. But in case we find a blobfish or an owl, I think I won't do that. Or even a whatever it's called. Clownfish. Any of those would be nice. 
I'm not going to buy a mouse anymore. They're not that efficient. And yeah, let's do this. It is a turtle. I could pull that onto there and feel pretty good. But it's not good yet. It's good in, like, the late game. And there's melon... Hmm. Nah, let's, let's do it. I, I feel like I probably do need that. Need this. And then, what? Freeze pill? <laughs> Freeze pill in case you find a rooster. I'll do it. I'll try and have at least one of each. So if I find a rooster, I will be getting that chick. <laughs> You're so bad. It's very luck based. I've had a very good run so far. I haven't found any owls, which would have been amazing. Same with the, um, whatever it's called. The hatching chicks, finding those would have been cool. Blobfish would be nice. Uh, oh, I'm gonna buy these. Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> okay, I can't do anything this turn, which is kind of sad. Because I can't buy the rooster and pill it this turn, so I have to keep it frozen. I'm not buying honey, so let's just continue to roll. That's tempting to freeze, but we don't have another level up yet, so I'll pass on that. Is anyone else running melon yet? There is one person running melon. If, if these baby ducks were, like, slightly bigger, my ones, I mean, I'd probably throw one to the front. Just to see if it could, like, trade with a, a tiny thing with meat, but they're too tiny. They won't do anything. They could pop a melon, but that is it. <laughs> it's actually soloing everything. Alright, another rooster. We don't need this many. We're fine. So we have this now. Could have bought a can and maybe had, like, one extra attack on the chick. Big brain. Won't do it. We're also leaving this. We don't need more. Uh, you know what? Yes. <laughs> oh, and I can buy a pair to finish, maybe? Freeze blobfish. Probably freeze blobfish and snail. There is a chance I lose. I don't think it's a huge chance, but... Yeah, and let's get one of these, like, a little bit more beefy. I'm going to leave, like, everything where it is, though. <laughs> okay, salads. Salads are okay, but next turn there's a chance we'll find um, zebras, which I would love. And I'm also going to leave blobfish. We don't even have a hatching chick yet. There's no point. They're trying their best. I can't remember what I said. If I have offended anyone, whether it's in-game, my own pets, or real-life people, I'm sorry. Alright, let's, let's start spreading out stats. Okay, I could buy salads, but it's not worth it. Like, there's zebra and cow. And <laughs> just finding another the hatching chick or something. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep buffing these. We're keeping everything separate. I'm not gonna freeze a turtle. We've found a hatching chick. Excellent. Hmm. That's worth it, right? I don't know how long this game is going to go on for, but it's probably worth trying to level it once. We'll try it. We're getting somewhere. I just need to get like permanent stats on my team somehow. I, I just want to roll and find like a full shop of zebras. That is the dream, I think. <laughs> this melon is doing great work. It wasn't even a real team, it was a other one. I actually can't get a level up here. Sadly, can't use the turkey for anything anymore. Is no, I can't buy that as well, right? Okay, so start buffing up one of these, because I, I don't know how long the lobby's going to go on for, but I kind of like the idea of spreading out the stats more in case I do get to get to a point where this is basically capped out, because a lot of the scaling in this is very random. Nah, none of this, alright. Although, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, I think I'm getting close to the point where I probably do want to pill another turtle, though. Is that or I go for weird other stuff and try and pill walruses? Which is definitely a possibility. How are the teams looking? I'm still not sure if it's worth like throwing one of these to the front. Ooh. A loss. Aloha, you got me. <laughs> hey, we got a snail. Alright. Not complete pain then. Uh, I guess I just buy food. Ooh. Freezy. 
Maybe we'll need that. We're definitely going to want to buy this. And yeah, it's ended again. I definitely need to find other food equipment though. I don't know how likely we are to die. But yeah. Yeah, I probably should have done something like this. Thrown a little one to the front. Who <laughs> has the massive duckling? A lot of people do. Like, look at these. Everyone has, like, one massive duckling. And then a lot of people have, like, big hatching chick chains. Sadly, I've only found one so far. Yeah, we're losing health again. Uh, oh, that's nice. Okay. Do, do, do. Yeah, you're getting buffed up the most, so we'll do this. Another hatching chick. Uh, it's a level up, maybe? Probably freeze both of these two. Maybe I just uh, like abandon the whatever it is, peanuts, you wars. We're getting pretty into the late game. I don't know if I can afford it, but yeah, let's just like freeze everything. Love that. I'm gonna leave the cat. It's good if we have food frozen or cows or something, but at the very least, I doubt we're going to get value out of it next turn. And let's do this. <laughs> just. Pop a shield. Hopefully this thing is big enough to get a trade. Seeing like seeing how this has been going though, I think it probably would have been better to just like pump this one still. Because yeah, these trades have not been optimal. A trade. A draw. Okay. Uh well, these are happening. <laughs> I'm doing both of these and I probably just buy both food. Yeah. Alright. There's so much melon at the front though. Actually, it's 50-50. So I could stake the front and then this is guaranteed to get to trade. It's not like insane value. We'd probably get the same if I just like melon it. But yeah. I'm just going to do this. Okay. Send it again. I really don't know why I've frozen this. Like, There's no point leveling the duckling. Unless I find like... <laughs> I don't even know. Like, Do I, do I still pull a boris if I find one? I need scaling more than anything. That's tier 5 stuff. I might just, like, unfreeze this. Lollipop the chick. I'm not lollipopping it. <laughs> oh no, this guy. Uh, we're top 5, so that's believe a game at least. But Yeah, we're in a rough spot at the moment. I'm going to leave the duckling. I could buy it and we can have a 5 squad, but... These things are so much better. I'm just buying other things. That's kind of tempting to have when there is like double war or so. The thing is, these things aren't big enough. This is the only one that would be able to trade with something that has melon armor. Uh, we, we need to leave. Okay. Just keep buffing things up. Okay, let's see. If we don't die, then we can maybe... We can maybe do something here. Build a warus, hopefully it lands on one of those two, and then that will do something for us. But, yeah. We might just be dead. And I embrace it. We had a good run. Yeah, <laughs> it just, it just insta-killed everything. It was too big. Alright, GG's. Top 5. Rex, Cyberhand. Click, like, and sub. Sky, good luck to the final people. You did well. Okay, can I change my background? Hmm. <laughs> I don't think that was randomized. Because I, I said this before I started the lobby, and it was the only thing that I, like, said not to have. This has been in the field this time. And, uh, yeah, guys, we're in. We're on the turtle pack base game, and we're doing swans only. So, yeah, hit and turn, only run swans. You're allowed to run whatever other food you want, so you can't have uh, honey on them and have, like, bees in combat like that, but... Yeah, hit and turn, only this. You can buy and sell other things like otters and whatever else, but please, when you end your turn, only swans. And I was hoping to find ducks. Yeah, I'm going to greed. I'd rather find ducks. Thank you. <laughs> One more duck. Thank you. Oh, just ask and you get it. This game is <laughs> this is the best. Duck combo frozen. Me too. Probably not going to get anything, but... I hope so. You got two ducks to start, roll ten times for another one. The thing is, that actually isn't even that bad luck. 
Because then you have like, because there's like, what, nine things here? Yeah, because you have one slot and you're rolling for one in nine each time. So it's not actually that likely to find it anyway. And I do not have a swan. <laughs> Shame. Now we roll for a slot. And we didn't find one. Just saw six horses go by and didn't freeze any of them. I don't blame you. Hog bounce. Wait, did you find a hog as well? That was like my combo thing. Oh no. I think someone messed up and then insta left. Of course you can hear me. Okay. Let's see. Show me them. I will be freezing these meat bones, because I think they are very useful on early swans. Okay, good. I've had worse starts. <laughs> we at least found a swan. I can get by with that. Did anyone find any early ones? Vessel did. We had two. Okay, so Mike and Vessel found some early ones. Just a standard swan. You only find a swan on two gold. At least you have it for next time, because... Yeah, in these kinds of lobbies, it's not that uncommon for some people to not find any for, like, the first couple of rounds or something of trying to find them. So, uh, yeah. My heart goes out to those people. And I lost HP anyway. <laughs> Why was it so big? Horses. I'm gonna buy these. No, it's I do that one. I'm gonna leave the other one. We need to find more swans while we're actually here. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's a rich get richer kind of thing. Like you, we don't find as many swans as you can early because they, they compound. The more money you have, the more swans you, or the more you can roll to find more swans, and you know feeds into itself. Debating whether I freeze that other meat bone. I may want to start buying salad bowls soon, but I think I probably do take at least one more. Still no swans. Let's see, that's what I mean. How are these getting so big, though? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna leave that meat bone. We, we're fine. Come on, more. No otter. More swans, please. More swans, sir. Or just buy a salad. <laughs> that didn't feel good. 10 gold for two tooth. Why'd you hear boss music? Where are these giant swans? Yeah, here's a 7-7. Seven, seven. What are they doing to these swans to, like, turn them into that? <laughs> Double cupcake, cupcake, probably. Does it not show the underline anywhere? Does it only show you the underline on, like, on your own team? Oh, pilling ants. Yeah, that could definitely be it. It explained why it had, like, you know, equal attack and health, too. Oh, there we go. <laughs> That's what I wanted. <laughs> right. Uh, yeah, I think I do probably put another meat bone on this. Like, I do want to buy pears and stuff, but... Or even buying cans might be okay. Buying, like, a can might be cool. And wait, there's a sloth? Hold on, where is he? There he is, uncool, congratulations. We have a sloth. I wish you luck. I hope your run doesn't die too soon. Rip Kino has more than me now. They're not very big though. Like, these things are a bit more spooky. Yeah, people are buffing up some pretty big swans. Uncool is now cool. <laughs> Wait, you, you, got, you got killed by the sloth. That's good. Continue dying to the sloth, everyone. Oh, no, it's this vessel. The scary team. That sounds good. I like that. <laughs> I almost wanted to like pill a turtle or something, but it's it's not worth it on these guys. It may be worth it if I start buying loads of pears. Let's leave it. Alright. I'm gonna start buffing up a different one, because if I do pill a turtle, 
Oh, there we go. Let's go buy that. I should have bought the can first. I'm dumb. All right, we can freeze this. Hoping to find a pill soon. Uh, if we lose, then we can use this at least. Is there any melon armor? There is no melon armor. There's no reason to throw a tiny one to the front. You're out. Found swans too late. I did see you say you found those swans like a few turns in. Sorry to hear it, but sometimes it goes like that. Honestly, I'm probably not far behind you because like, I'm kind of expecting another loss here. And then I'm going to be on lethal, and then who knows what's going to happen after that. Yeah. I should have bought the meat bone. <laughs> I should have bought it. Okay, well, now I actually have to combine these, which doesn't feel amazing, but sure. Okay. At least I can do this. Like, this is an improvement. Hey, that's not too bad. And then we can just, like, do this. Alright, I'm hoping I don't die this turn, at least. I'm going to leave the cans. Oh... And suddenly I get all this luck. I don't know whether it's, whether it's better to throw this guy to the front. I kind of like all my top heavy guys being at the front instead. I'm going to leave it like this. I may be dead. I just may be dead. <laughs> you got a good death speed run for real. Yeah, I, I think I'm doing the same. I've lost like the last three games in a row. I'm probably about to die. You focused on buying too many swans and not buffing them. Uh, I mean, I I feel like it's worth it if you don't die. Because again, the more swans you have, like, you know, having like five swans on the team or something, it does mean that you get a lot of extra gold, which means you can then buff yourself even more later. Oh, <laughs> I have to. <laughs> which means I have to move a, lose a meat thing. Okay. Throw this onto there, because if I'm getting better equipment, I probably want to put like another melon on another big one, so I'll combine that into this. Do that. Take you. <laughs> okay. I like that. Uh, I don't know whether I freeze a pill. I probably don't. I don't know whether I invest in chocolate. Like, I'm too close to dying. I need to get melon on this, but I may wait until, you know, tier 11 melon. I'm going to put this here, though. Let's see if that can get a better trade now that it's actually pretty high attack. You found 11 swans? Wait, what am I at? Because these are like 3 each. I'm like near there. I'm like 9. Thank you for not killing me. And I'm sorry if I've killed you. Alright, oh, we're just buying stats. Like, there aren't that many great, like, buy-sell things here. There is cow and you can pill mammoths. But we're probably just going this route. Scale with food we find. Uh, yeah, pump that, continue rolling. I'll freeze that. I probably do freeze a salad bowl as well. <laughs> we send it to get and hope we don't die. Maybe should have unfrozen it actually, because we are definitely at the point where putting melon on like this and this would be an improvement. It's like, as good as getting extra stats are, they're not as good as having extra stats on things that have better equipment. Oh, and the sloth is dead. Where is he? There he is. I'm sorry, Uncle. It was too soon. You deserved better. Chili would be pretty good in this game. Not against my team. <laughs> I mean, maybe for the front one, but... Oh. Damn, they did. <laughs> it's okay. I can... I'll be an underdog. I'll recover. I'm buying these people of gold. Freeze it. Don't buy it yet. We need... I think I can just buy all this. I can like level up another swan, buy the pet. I don't know how much I can greed. I'm gonna try. <laughs> gonna try and greed. Oh, there are so many frontline peppers. Oh, there's frontline peppers everywhere. Alright, you're going to the front. Put you here as well. Okay. I think there are teams here that can kill me, but I think a lot of these teams I also beat. So I'm not I'm not too worried. Hopefully I go against one of the teams that I can manage to stomp. Down <laughs> to 16 swans, that's too many. I disagree. You can't have too many swans. Always more. Kinda wish I could use the cats, but we don't even have food for them. 
All right, definitely buying this. So I could buy other equipment. I could put it on here because it doesn't have any equipment yet. But yeah, big thing needs good equipment. I'll put this one on there because again, the Safu is going to be random, and I can just start investing like that. Yeah. Okay. Can we leave the chili? Mm, wait. I don't know how bad. I <laughs> These are getting scary. There aren't that many chilies around anymore, actually. I don't know if the chili teams died. Never mind. There's like four of them here. Hmm. I'm gonna freeze it anyway. I don't mind, even if people are like countering it. I think it's still worth going for. Hey. <laughs> still getting somewhere. Okay, steak. Steak on my baby swan is not a terrible idea. And then I'm basically set for a long time, I just need to scale. Oh, there we go. Double salad. <laughs> a little bit weak, but it's something. Right. Do I want to put this to the front, or is chili still a problem? Chili is still very much a problem, okay. But none of these chilies are big enough to... Never mind, that one's big enough to survive a hit, and some of the other ones might have scaled as well. Ooh. I'm going to trust that I don't go against this team... I might go against that one, which is also a problem. I don't know how much people are going to be scaling. I I hope this doesn't die. If that dies because it gets hit by Chili twice, then that's going to be pretty sad. But if I move it to the front, then that's almost guaranteeing that this one gets Chili swiped. And yeah. <laughs> they did it, but we're okay anyway. It wasn't even one of the teams I was looking at. It's a different one. Okay. <laughs> Crazy. No point buying yet. Uh, hmm. Buy salad, freeze chocolate. Okay. Yeah, you're still... Yeah, you're still too weak. <laughs> there are just so many frontline chilies. Oh, I hate it. Wait, why? Where's the, where are the scary ones? All of these die in one hit. So am I safe to leave it like this again? I can't tell if I'm losing my mind. <laughs> Jay, what is happening? Getting hit with emotional music when you lose. Mm. I'm dead. <laughs> okay, Destructo, you got me. I am free. Hold on, what was the prediction? Top six. I don't think I'm in top six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm in top seven. So yeah, that is a doubter game. GG though, that wasn't a bad that wasn't bad. I just lost a lost a lot of HP pretty early. But uh yeah, to everyone still remaining. I <laughs> wish you luck. And there is like ten minutes left, so I think I will run another one. But it's going to be it's gonna be something that you can start on early. Okay, guys, we're doing same tier only, or one tier only. That means everything on your team has to be from the same tier. So, first couple of turns, obviously, you're basically just going to be running tier 1s. Uh, but if you want to pivot to something else, then you have to sell everything and start over with a new tier. So, let's say you have, like, a full tier 1 team. At some point, you may get to, like, you know, turn 7 or something, and then you want to move over to tier 3s or tier 4s. You have to sell everything and then just completely start over with new tier 4s. So, again, when you hit end turn, everything on your team has to be the, from the same tier. That is the only condition. Uh, hmm. Combinations aren't actually that insane, but <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe I buy all of this anyway. Okay, let's be the purple streamers. Here's Twitch. <laughs> he has the motherly uncles. Solid name. Okay, safe. I have defeated myself in cricket auto combat. Alright, well, if I'm buying these, I should do it this way. Uh, let's do it this way. Let's have one horse, double cricket. Double mosquito, I mean. Okay, this isn't insane because these things aren't good to sell to pivots. Like, if I had a load of ducks and beavers or ants to pill, maybe, there would have been use here. Like, none of this. None of this is good long term for me. Like, it doesn't help me pivot. Sad to miss the next lobby, but I can't seem to die in Swan Lobby. <laughs> I'm sorry, Pocket. 
I would have waited longer, but I'm I'm trying to be more strict about like the time so I don't overrun by like 20 minutes, which I've been doing a lot recently. And when I do that like several segments in a row, that ends up like the stream stretching out an extra like hour. Which uh not the best. Okay, another good fight. I'm sorry for costing people HP. I <laughs> I'd be taking draws. Still only tier ones, interesting. Hmm. I don't think I can pivot, yes. I think I start looking for combinations. I think I can take that. Uh hmm. Maybe combine my crickets. Combine crickets by the duck. Freeze this, then I can get like a load of combinations next turn and then pivot to tier three the turn after. Oh yeah. <laughs> I think that's it. Okay. Not unhappy with that. If you get stream elements to spam, can we ban them? No, I'm not stramming my stramming. I'm not banning my stream elements, baby bot. No, you're four gold. What do you do? Oh god, there's loads of combinations here. Okay, we're definitely pivoting to tier threes. Not this turn, because it's gonna be too costly. Unless I pivot to tier fours. How expensive would that be? Because I need to. I have one combination. No, they're all here. Hmm. I think by duck? I don't know. I'm losing it. What's the best way to do this? I'm gonna buy duck. I'm gonna just buy some stuff here, I think. Just don't lose. We're going to get the combinations next turn. We're gonna get three combinations and then I'm gonna pivot to tier fours. <laughs> and I'm hoping it won't get me killed. I, I just have to hope they're good tier fours. If we get like... I don't know, what are the bad tier fours in this? There's gotta be bad tier fours. Okay, anyway, let's try it. So, what, if, what do you have? Penguin? That's not good. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, that's not a good start. Dude, that is a good start. And you... Skunk. Uh, there's something to this. Maybe I, like, keep them frozen? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I can afford to do this. Nah. If it throws, it throws. I'm just gonna have to do it like this, otherwise. Oh. Okay. There we go. <laughs> not not really the team I wanted, but maybe. Our bus is tier one. Deer is tier four. Oh, we got a trade. I actually went against another tier four team. <laughs> Alright. Definitely buying this. Uh, we continue to buy this. I'll be changing order a bit too. In case I go against another bus, maybe I'll do this. Mm, I'll probably just roll, right? I could buy honey. I don't know if that actually saves me much. But also, if I'm rolling, I'm not freezing anything. Unless I, I may freeze salad. Garlic's a maybe, but I probably want to pill a turtle instead. Let's roll. I don't want to do that. I'll freeze salad. I do think that's worth buying. And I <laughs> see snail's probably it too. Probably going to need it. And if I'm freezing a salad, I should freeze a turtle. You should do a no rules lobby and a randomized pack. We've done it before. I won't be doing it today. This is the last one of today, but yeah. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't lose any HP on this like early pivot. Another oh, dear, excellent. Alright, buy salad, buy other deer. Uh, I'm probably staying at tier 4. This is just insane. This is, this is an amazing team. I don't know how we'd pivot off this, and this is pretty solid. So yeah, I, I'm pretty happy with this. Oh dear, yeah, you should be afraid. Let's see. So yeah, Sky is on another tier 4 team with a very scary hippo, actually. That got very big very fast. Tier 3 team there. Tier 3 here, tier 2. There's quite a lot of variety. There are a few teams that went like tier 4 early. Oh, I'm very sorry. <laughs> this, is, this is like the perfect team for me to go against. Waza, I'm sorry. That was, that was a brutal fight. <laughs> no one wanted to be a part of that. Okay. 
I'm buying these pets. I could roll for level ups maybe, but the stats... The stats are so big. And I don't actually know if I want to pivot at all. I think buffing you isn't a terrible idea. <laughs> I could maybe buy cans and then look to pivot later. Because this will keep me going for a long time. Probably. But again, I can just lock in. Like, If I level the whale, level the deer, get the skunk leveled up, this can go pretty far. You don't know how your tier 3 pivot worked, but it did. I was really scared for mine. I thought I was going to lose the first turn. I was surprised that I didn't. And then the second turn was also like a close win somehow. I want to fill your PC crash. That is not good. What do I do? Pump the whale, probably. Yeah, let's, let's pump the whale. We're keeping it. I, I think this just is the team. I completely forgot about the penguin, though. Like, yeah, getting level ups would have been really nice. <laughs> okay. Uh, cow. Probably. I could combine there and then buy sell cow. I will be doing stuff with chocolate, but... I think we can use that. I'm debating how well we use the uh, penguin, though. Your outs. Oh, damn. I saw a food build there. Was it like double squirrel, double worm or something? Oh god, we killed... We killed the kangaroo. That was very good for us. I see the monkey and I... I almost want to throw and just go like super hard on monkeys, but I don't think that's it. Alright, so we get to get some extra stuff on our team. I want this to trigger like before anything else. And I'm just playing this. Like, there's no point. Like, if I level this, it does get stats, but then it just gets eaten anyway, so it doesn't matter. I'd rather just do this, I think. Freeze that. Everything else is pretty good. You go back in? Oh, great. <laughs> Damn. That scoping got two hits in, and this is a scary team. Hold on, how much HP does Kraken have? I could see that going somewhere very spooky. Or did I just kill him? I'm sorry. If I just killed you, I'm very sorry. Alright, so, uh, let's... Let's make some room. I'm probably gonna do this as well. That's not too bad. I'll run a four squad if I have to. I almost want to pivot to tier sixes, but... <laughs> I'm just locking in. I'm too lazy. Can't be bothered. We're scaling with the penguin, but this one doesn't matter at all. We will have three big buses, though. Not bad. Just in time to lose. Yeah, if you lost a lot of, uh, well, you know, missed a lot of rounds, you can definitely see that happen. Sky, hello. Very sorry. You've been outbussed. Right, so I can do this on there, maybe, but I don't know. I'm debating whether I just get rid of it. I also kind of want to play that on top. Like, with this current setup, I... I, could, I don't know, I could do this, maybe. That's fine. I'd have to move something else to the front. So I could do this, and then I could stake it. And then scaling this actually does, like, benefit us. I think that's fine. And you know what? I am I think this is the team. <laughs> I am locking in. I'm happy. Let's see, though. I, I always, always forget to check, and then I get there way too late. <laughs> we didn't stick up. The stake was so good. going pretty well. No, because you lose the deer with the mushroom. Except I didn't. You died to Kino clone. I'd apologize, but it wouldn't be sincere. <laughs> Alright, send it again then. Not even the real one. It does hurt, yeah. Yeah, so everyone's tier 4 or tier 3. No one's tried to pivot higher. Oh, actually, no, people did try, but they died. Oh, God, that's sad. <laughs> oh, they tried to go for a tier 5 pivot, but they had one rhino. Oh, Jazz, hello. I didn't know you were here. Okay. Uh, how long are we in the lobby for? Is it worth trying to level the penguin? 
Maybe. <laughs> I do need better equipment, but I'd rather get, like, either steak on this. I want melon on there. I haven't seen it yet. I think trying to level this is fine as well. I just make sure of 5 5 on the bus. If we do get it leveled up anyway. I'm gonna roll the rest. Hey, okay, there we go. I will not be mushrooming that one, though. <laughs> kind of snuck in. Hey, you're very welcome to. It lived. Oh, yeah, I guess it's only six damage. This might actually be a flawless thing of the lobby. I'm not going to get much stronger by like buying the skunk, so I may leave it there. Try and roll for better equipment, see if I can get a flawless win. Some scary things at the front. I think I am going to stake this. Stake that, throw it there. I guess I do buy it, because if I roll, then I can't buy anything this turn anyway. So I'll just, I'll just take that. Okay. You're running a four squad, hate tier threes. <laughs> What's wrong with tier threes? Oh, I had perfect attack to kill that. I had exactly 27 with the stake. Sean, I'm sorry. Are you dead? You're dead. Just you and, <laughs> you and me, Jazz. We have the level up too. <laughs> that thing is dead. I'm sorry to say. Uh, another steak. I guess I stake the whale. I'm just set. This is a very meaty team. Yeah, I don't think I need to change anything either. I think I'm solid where I am. Oh no, wait! I lost the bus. The snipes were enough for my deer. I think we're fine anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well GG's. You don't think your chance is that high? You almost did have me. Like, you killed this deer, so my whale ate this one, and I lost the extra mushroom thing. So that nearly did screw me over, but... Yeah, that was good. I actually flawless the lobby. Excellent stuff. GG's, everyone. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for being a part of that domination. <laughs> Hacks? Oh, yeah, I definitely hacked my lobby. That was a good one, though. Alright, so what's the time? Full past. Plot armor scammed. Hey, people always say this, but no one ever remembers the lobbies where I'm like the first to die. When I'm dead like five minutes in and then I don't know what to do because everyone else is still in the lobby. And if I make a new one, then there's <laughs> no one ready for it. These are the good ones though. Okay, anyway, I will be changing games now though. We're going to be moving on to Brotato. I'm going to change the docket before I do anything, but... For everyone that was only here for SAP, hope you had a good time.